But uh, this coronavirus thing has put me in a lockdown with my family, and now I know my family much more than I did. So the first thing is that people have learned more about their families, and that's a very, very, very important uh, uh, lesson. Uh, how do you, you build a dynamic with your family and how you keep this dynamic, the best parts of it, going forward? So um, is this a good thing? For me, it has been a good thing. But it also provides us some opportunities for the future to say, how do we build our business so that we can continue to spend more time with the family um, and also spending more valuable time with the friends or the colleagues, not just for the sake of making money, but also for the sake of improving our knowledge base, not, not from a business perspective, but from a personal perspective. From my perspective of business, this has been a strangely a blessing. Half of my clients are basically are destined to disappear. And five times that, they're turning around and coming to me and say, oh, now I need a digital transformation. Now I need artificial intelligence. Now I need automation. And I tell them, yes, do automation, but not for the sake of making more money or saving money, but to improve your knowledge base. So if you do knowledge, uh, automation, to improve your knowledge base so that you can provide better services to your employees, first of all, because employees are more important, in my opinion, than customers. And once your employees are very, very happy and motivated and they know what is then their end goal in life, then you provide real value to your customers. But you can't have like a, a company just for the sake of making money because then employees are unhappy. They are not aware of what's going on and uh, they are not part of the benefits uh, nor the challenges. And so, so, you know, the company is destined to fail, you know. So okay. automation can actually narrow the gap between uh, uh, goals and uh, employees. And then together we grow a better service or product. 